Facebook has enacted an emergency shutdown of two artificial intelligence programs. The social media giant leapt into action after it discovered the two programs were writing their own code. Is it possible for an AI to generate another AI? It's a question that has been asked for decades, and all indications lead to a resounding yes. But how is this even possible? How can something relatively complicated as artificial intelligence become something so simple to generate? The process might be a bit complex, but let's take a look and see if we can figure out how this is possible. First and foremost, let us ensure that everyone is on the same page about artificial intelligence (AI). In a nutshell, AI is a computer system replicating human behavior by performing activities such as data analysis, pattern recognition, decision-making, problem-solving, and learning from past experiences. It takes your commands and executes them to fulfill various tasks. Now that we've covered the fundamentals, let's return to our initial question. Can an AI generate another AI? While it is conceivable, it is not without the assistance of humans initially. An AI must be programmed before it can be built, and humans must do this programming. Once successfully trained, an AI can use its provided skill set to build more AIs based on those instructions. So while strictly speaking, yes, an AI may build another AI. Since 2017, there have been reports of AI generating additional AIs, often known as child AIs. This procedure is not self-contained. AI that can create other AI is typically designed for this purpose and taught how to do it. As with many areas of AI technology, the question of whether AI can create other AI is not binary. The answer to the question, could AI learn to create itself, is yes. It should be mentioned that there are two types of learning, formal and informal. What a teacher is teaching can be learned. In this situation, the teacher usually has a specific purpose in mind. When the teacher's goal is realized, learning is successful. Learning that is supervised. Learning can also take place without the intervention of a third party. There is no preset notion of success in this circumstance. Any type of learning is considered successful. Learning without supervision. The comparison above corresponds to the two forms of AI machine learning. One is AI-assisted learning, in which the learning outcome is predefined, and two is unsupervised learning in AI, where the outcome is unclear. Machine learning, ML, is another critical component here. AI and machine learning have enabled the automation of a wide range of operations, from facial recognition to self-driving cars. But can an AI build another AI? The quick answer is that an AI can create another AI, or self-replicate. While it may appear impossible, AI can eventually build clones of itself. Because of the machine learning process, this will be achievable. Algorithms for machine learning allow machines to learn from data without being explicitly programmed. This means that AI devices can learn about the world around them by analyzing massive volumes of data. This technique produces AI-generated models, which can subsequently be utilized to create new copies of themselves. Deep learning is a sort of machine learning, in which neural networks replicate the brain's ability to perceive patterns and make decisions based on those patterns. Deep learning models can be trained on massive data sets and used to produce new models that are similar, but not identical to their forefathers. So, how does all of this relate to developing artificial intelligence? When a model based on deep learning is trained on data, it generates a set of parameters that define its behavior and capability. These factors can then be merged with additional parameters from different datasets or AI models to produce a new model with capabilities or behaviors distinct from its predecessor. This procedure could produce an altogether new AI-generated model capable of performing tasks beyond those envisioned by its original developers. AI could and has already learned to make itself through supervised learning. Unsupervised learning as a field of AI, on the other hand, is still in its infancy, and no documented AI has learned to build additional AIs on its own. But even so, researchers have already created AI capable of creating other AI. It is now possible to develop an AI that can produce other AIs that are focused on algorithms rather than sentient beings, 
As seen in science fiction films and maybe in the future, an AI can be a sentient super program capable of incredible feats of intelligence, consciousness, morality, and so on. However, real-world AI is not yet that sophisticated. Modern AIs are sophisticated and well-trained algorithms that excel at particular jobs. Unsurprisingly, any AI they develop will be a single-purpose algorithm. This brings us to the concept of child AI. If you are wondering what exactly a child AI is, well, with the release of ChatGPT4 and BARD, artificial intelligence on the internet by Microsoft and Google, a child AI could be one of the scariest things on Earth. Google AutoML was released in May 2017, while NASNet was released in November to automate machine learning models and reduce the labor requirements of human data scientists in building artificial intelligence AI, algorithms. These would subsequently include labeled data, computer vision, and natural language processing NLP. Google announced the development of a controller neural net in 2017 that can propose a child model architecture that can then be trained and graded for quality on a specific job. The controller then uses that information to improve its proposals for the next round. They repeat this process thousands of times, creating new structures, testing them, and providing feedback to the controller so that it can learn. Google's AutoML AI Child is a Google AI that can create other AIs. Before AutoML, Google had a huge challenge. Developing machine learning algorithms took significant time and effort. So, they had a clear goal from the start, to design an AI that could help them build further AIs, aka machine learning, ML models. And they were successful in their endeavor. AutoML can construct machine learning algorithms, AIs, that are as successful as human-created ML algorithms. Even better, these child AIs are often more accurate. And because the parent AI does some of the job rather than programmers, it is a less labor-intensive approach. NASNet, a child AI specifically designed for object recognition, is a superb example of AutoML. NASNet performed 1.2% better than any other current system. While success stories like AutoML are amazing, the resulting artificial intelligence is limited to narrow, highly specialized vocations. While young AIs such as NASNet are useful, they cannot match or surpass human intellect. The Google AutoML technique is promising and is currently available on the market for training custom machine learning models. There have been and will continue to be advancements since Google open-sourced NASNet so that it may be utilized for applications. And as we explore further in, what is a child AI? Could AI create other AI without the need for human intervention? In the Google example above, AutoML was deliberately designed to automate the creation of machine learning algorithms. Humans instruct and direct AutoML in the creation of AI. An equally intriguing situation is when an AI generates a kid AI on its own. Is this even possible? In terms of unsupervised learning, AI researchers have made promising progress, demonstrating that AI can theoretically learn to build other AI on its own. The paired open-ended trailblazer, Poet, is an example of advancement in this field. Earlier in the video, we discussed the distinction between supervised and unsupervised learning. Google's AutoML is a textbook example of supervised learning. Google desired that AutoML learn how to develop machine learning algorithms. That was the sole metric of success. Unsupervised machine learning aims to learn anything rather than a specific thing. And the optimization of agents in Uber's paired open-ended trailblazer, Poet algorithm, exemplifies this wonderfully. Poet is a system developed by Uber's AI section. The system is constantly creating new surroundings and challenges for bots to overcome. There is no clear goal, hence, it is open-ended. The agents are taught how to overcome difficulties provided by obstacle courses. When a problem is solved, a new one arises. The system might continue indefinitely, creating new problems indefinitely. That means that when the agents learn how to solve the problems, an infinite number of solutions will be devised allowing for the element of surprise. In such cases, agents have shocked researchers by proposing solutions humans had not considered. 
Who knows, perhaps one of those solutions will be the creation of an AI employing AI-generating algorithms. Overall, an AI can self-replicate using machine learning methods such as deep learning neural networks. Training these networks on massive datasets allows them to produce their own set of parameters, which can then be merged with other AI models to create a new version of itself, with different capabilities than its predecessor had intended for it. This opens up interesting new avenues for research into artificial intelligence and machine learning. So there you have it. An AI is capable of creating an AI, but currently, with a bit of assistance from US humans. Since its humble origins decades ago, this technology has come a long way and continues to evolve on a daily basis. While artificial intelligence companies have made significant advances in AI technology since its beginnings, many obstacles must be overcome before we can anticipate AI-created artificially intelligent beings anytime soon. While AIs may do specific jobs independently, they still require human input to do so efficiently and precisely, something that will remain true until AIs outperform their human counterparts. Until then, humans will continue to play a critical role in developing new artificial intelligence-powered devices. If you have made it this far into the video, then please like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already. We really appreciate your support.